Well, today's been an exciting day. Psych! Big ass rock on the goddamn road. I would call it a stone. It was fucking massive, damn it. It was too late to see anything. God. Fuck. Oh shit, you know what I just remembered? Just remember something. Damn. But now I'm back in this one. Back in the left. Yo, what's up guys? We was America. I'm in the Lexus, unfortunately, because a stupid boulder was in the road and messed up my BMW as you saw on my wheels. So came over here to get my replacements. Oh god. Cool guy. Dude name is Jason. Uh, you, dude, the more I drive this Lexus, the more I don't want to get rid of the Lexus. I love this car so much. But yeah. Now to wait for my wheels I ordered to come in. Or I mean my tires and do. It'll be back on the road, Jack. Now let's go find something to eat. Yo. Damn. Sun shining in here. On this blessed day. Because I'm still alive. What's going on guys? It's your boy Chuck with the BMW. Man, do I have a story to tell? Uh, I think I included the first clip is the wheel being messed up after running over quite the size of a boulder rock um, coming off of the beltway. Not good. One out of five would not recommend doing that. Uh, bought me a new wheel. The only one that was available. Doesn't match very much, but you can't, you can't really tell. <clears throat> Granted, it's not the exact wheel. And I got some new tires, so I'm good now. BMW is back on the road. Giving me some codes, but I mean, what more do I expect, right? Dang, tell me shit about my BMW, what the fuck? Um, but yeah, I had COVID for two weeks. I was out for two weeks. That... I was not asymptomatic. That shit hit me like a train. No, I would... I hope nobody ever experiences that. And I know people had it worse than me. People had it worse than me and... They didn't make it. There was a point I didn't think I was going to make it. But thanks to the Lord above i made it. i was out for two weeks from work home quarantined in a room shit drove me nuts i couldn't do anything couldn't go out couldn't do shit plenty of rest though but when you're sick that's what you need and uh yeah man it was horrible felt like my skull was gonna crack split open with the headaches chain uh, pain in my chest couldn't breathe Struggling to breathe. Man, my throat was so sore. The phlegm hit different this time. My throat was burning. It was it was not fun. It was horrible. But <clears throat> it's over. My girl took care of me. Plenty of crackers and Gatorade. And medicine from the doctor. I went a whole week thinking it was something else, hoping I would get better. And granted, I may have gotten better slightly, but that very weekend, that very weekend, I lost the taste and the smell. And I was like, oh shoot. I didn't get tested, but when that, when that happened, I knew it. So I went to get tested and sure enough, it was positive. I was hoping it wouldn't be, but it was. So I quarantined the two little ones we have was they were okay. Nothing wrong with me. 
Dude, when you have little ones, that stuff is scary. Last thing you want to do is give it to one of the kids. But, um, they were, luckily they were good. I'm gonna leave my car here. I gotta go grab some. BRB. Man, let's see how sturdy this is. <laughs> I got no covering, no case. Let's hope it stays. But yeah, like I was saying, I'm back at work being in sales. It's not very good to be out for so long, but let me tell you, your uh, your health is one thing that does uh that you just can't put second, man. You gotta make sure you're good. I know life sometimes can seem like it's all about making money, but at the end of the day, you being 100%. It's way more important. You gotta be really, really on top of looking after yourself. And I'm, I'm a hustler. I mean, being out of work for that long was not a vacation. It, being in bed and quarantine for two weeks doesn't help, and then not selling anything doesn't help either. But this COVID stuff hits different. Like, I knew the moment I started feeling weird, I knew it. And, like, I started feeling sick, but it didn't feel like anything i ever been through. I had a feeling it was COVID that first week. That second week, I just had to confirm it. There's no way I'm going back to work without a negative test result, which is what I did. I went ahead and make sure I got a, a negative test. I made sure I got that done. I told you it wasn't gonna hold. That 335 i power, I knew it wasn't gonna hold. Hey phone, you okay? You good? Luckily it landed in my center, so. It looks fine. <clears throat> Slightly used phone for sale. Oh, we're good now. But, uh, you know, I don't like doing these videos while I'm driving, so. We'll go ahead and focus on the road. Um, when I park, I'll show you guys the wheels to see if y'all can tell the difference. I honestly couldn't the first time I saw it on the car. Um, but dang, look at this. Pay attention to everything you're doing, guys, because stuff like that be all on the road. Um, and that's why I'm getting off my GoPro right now. When I stop, when I get home, I'll be back. So then, let me focus. I'll see you guys. Made it home. As promised, <coughs> mm, pardon me. Let's take a look at the different wheels while I wait for her. Oh, look at the Lexus. Wait for my girl to open it up. So, okay, so this is the wheel I replaced, right? It looked so similar. This is the original wheel. Oh, look, she opened it. It looks so similar. God damn, I thought it was all put together. Fuck, this is the wheel that got fucked. Hold on, let me uh, let me pull it out first. Hold on, let me sit, sit you guys in the trunk. I heard some rumbling while I was driving. It was this. All right, so tire, of course, got fucked. I didn't even need to replace it, but it got fucked anyways. Look at this. God dang, he done fucked it up. Ugh. That is so screwed. As you can tell though, this spoke is actually on the lug nut on the replacement. So there's your difference, see? But it's unnoticeable unless you really look and pay attention at it. I think. And the tire that got fucked. Where is it? It's on the side. Oh wait, this is the one. This is my one from the passenger. This isn't the one that got fucked. My boy Paco looking out for me. It looks like it got plugged. It looks like it's got a plug. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, official snow baby. It's official. Hello baby. Yeah. The beautiful emerald making an appearance. Always a welcoming sight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just doing a video about how I fucked up the wheel. <laughs> hmm. And the uh, not so much different wheels. But you know the story. I'm back at COVID. The car's fixed. The plate's on. I need to fix the dents, wrap it white, black accents, and it's done. Maybe aftermarket wheels later. But I gotta go because it's fucking cold out here. See you guys next time. Peace.